Alright folks, sorry this video is really chopped up, but people have seen me setting up this shower system on the vehicle and everybody's curious about what I'm doing, so they come up and they don't realize that I'm videotaping and they want to ask me what's going on, so I go through and give them the explanation of what I'm going to give you right now. I've already set up the system, it's completely uh, installed on the vehicle. Now, the only thing that has to be hard mounted onto the vehicle is this heat exchange unit right here. All the other the hoses and pump and clamps and everything else I keep stored in a five gallon bucket. So, completely set up, start off with my water source. I just got a nice little freshwater creek going underneath this right here on this hill. And down there I have a pre-filter with the hose running all the way up to my 12 volt pump. And the 12 volt pump is tied into my vehicle battery. And then from that 12 volt pump, I have the red intake line that goes to the heat exchange unit. Now it doesn't matter which way you go, um, plug it into the heat exchange unit. It's just a matter of whether you're standing on the front or the rear of the vehicle, where you want your output line. And the blue line is the output line. And right now I've just got it draped on the front bumper. I've already got it plugged in. All I have to do is open the flow valve. And you see that I get a nice little shower. And I can set the temperature however I'd like. The engine temperature runs up to 210 degrees. So depending on how fast or slow I run the water through the heat exchange unit, and then it also depends upon how cold or hot my water source is. One of the things that I do to make things more comfortable when taking a shower is I have a bridging ladder that I carry in the trailer of my Jeep. And you can just stand on the grating and the water flows underneath without getting mud all over your feet. So there you have it. My uh, onboard vehicle shower. Uh, this one was uh, distributed by r and Specialties. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching and be safe out there.